Welcome. Which division is superior? We're going to find out today. And we're joined by a little cat. Ooh, she's pretty. Mic volume up, you got it. Uh, uh, wow, okay. There we go. Music down. Mic volume up. Scholars are still doing assassination videos. Wow. That's pretty intense. Make Lionheart 3. Well, we are actually going to be giving away <clears throat> some paid access Robux for you or a friend as a part of some giveaways from now on. So, we're not going to be making it free, but there's a chance you could win access. But that means you have to watch the stream. And the giveaways could happen at any time, at any moment. So, you gotta stay tuned. For example, we could do a giveaway right now, or not. Really, it's just up to me. I'm the tyrant that's controlling this world. Okay, let's do that division tier list. Let's see, where did I put this thing? Before we start, <laughs> Yuri has a little, uh, Yuri made a little something something. Sivalin made something for us. I have not watched this, but I am looking forward to watching it with you all. 
as a intro to the stream. One second. for a little highlight just a little bit of a highlight time oh boy working I gotta go. Let's do display cap. All right. I don't know what this is. This could be radically inappropriate. I have no idea. This could be. This could be insane. This could literally be nuts. could be crazy but I don't think it will be it's gonna be nuts okay, it's muted so that doesn't help <laughs> okay it's it's working but I gotta turn the volume up Everybody calm down. Divisions are coming. He made it pretty quiet. I gotta freaking turn this up. Okay, it's max volume. I hope it's loud enough. I am the teeth in the darkness, the talent in the light. Mine is strength and lust and power. I am power! Let's freaking go! Let's go! <laughs> Hell Divers 2. Look familiar? Look familiar? Look familiar? Look familiar? <laughs> Let's go! live reacting to my own ah! no! we're never gonna make it we're never gonna make it they're here this music is fucking epic no ah! i love you guys i hope we make it out of here alive ah! oh my god this is pretty sick This is pretty sick. That was pretty funny. This is pretty freaking sick. That was really funny. I guess you- I should have hit my cam because you couldn't see me screaming. That was still really funny. I'm gonna post that video. That's really funny. Good job, Yuri. Good job, Sivlin. Wow. Let's rewatch that screaming real quick. Music is fucking epic. No! I love you guys. I hope we make it out of here alive. Oh my god! This is pretty sick. This is pretty sick.
This is pretty freaking sick. Scare screaming in terror is unmasculine and undemocratic. That's true. I gotta get myself together. I gotta get myself together. That was really funny. Dude, the bugs were coming, man. It's all coming together. All right. Time to do the tier list for the divisions. Where is this division tier list? We have a faction leaders tier list. Oh boy, and it's like super low freaking quality, man. I'll do the faction leaders tier list. And I will also do... Uh, where's the division tier list, man? Somebody was making it. Um, where the heck are, heckity heck is this thing? Didn't somebody make a sub faction tier list? Oh, thank you for sending me the ping. There we go. All right. This is going to be difficult. Okay. Here we go. We're going presentation mode. Actually, presentation mode's not as good. Because you can't see the chat. Alright. Alright. Which sub-faction is superior? Okay, so while I'm doing this, I'm gonna go in game. There's a chance the giveaway could be in game, guys. So if you're not in game, and you're gonna have a disadvantage inherently towards the giveaway, potentially. Forcing you to play. I can believe it. Actually. Okay, I made a poll in YouTube as well. This will be for after we do the tier list. After we do the tier list, which are we going to play? Are we going to play Lionheart's Crusade? Are we going to play Dark Souls? Are we going to play Helldivers 2 or CK3? Right now, Lionheart's is getting the majority of the votes. It's almost like we're Lionheart's players. Ah! 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 
No, I don't want to die. I'm just here for fun. Wow, we didn't even capture this yesterday? Okay, just kill me. Nice. Wow. The pull continues to go. Lionheart's number one, Helldivers two, Dark Souls, and CK3 tied for third. Okay, what's our first division on this list? Uh, for our first division, we have something of Basra. But I'm thinking these are Abbasid divisions, so we're going to go to Abbasids. The Sheikdom of Bars as Basra. Meaning Overwatcher in Arabic, Basra is an important historical Islamic city. That's pretty cool. I've never heard of this division. People add divisions sort of without telling me, so... I should pay more attention, but I don't. Kind of a cool outfit. Not the best. For that reason, C tier. C tier today. I don't know enough about them. I do know some of these divisions, but Basra, you're C tier. You got some work to do, buddy. Next, we have Balikdom of Advaz. 221 members, that's not bad. Well, their members either wear nothing or pilgrim outfits, I guess. Flourished as a center of cultivation, home to well many known scholars, being a part of the greater Kustan. Avaz is one of the richest and most prosperous cities of Persia. Now they are Malikdom, contributing, defending against the Crusaders of the Third Crusade under the allegiance of Caliph al Nasir. Okay, kind of a base description. So, because the description is based, they're going to get to B tier. But I have the same problem with them. Next, we have the Emirate of Kufa and Sawad. I really like this logo. I really like this logo is freaking epic. Kufa is one of the oldest Islamist historic cities with a previous capital for Abbasids and Rashidins. While Sawad is an important agricultural land for Abbasids being the biggest provider of food. Okay, this logo is really sick. I almost don't even care. They're like a food. They, they give people food. I see you, dude. Stupid. Where can I go where I can have peace? If your computer can't handle Baghdad, then you are a traitor. You are a traitor. If your computer cannot handle Baghdad, it's a skill issue. You don't deserve to be here. Only makes sense that we review Abbasid divisions in Baghdad. Baghdad. Nasty place. Why is it nighttime? There's no stars in Baghdad. These frame drape these frame drops you're noticing is just on your end. It's just your internet to the stream. It's not actually my computer.
Okay. Emirate of Kufa and Sawad. Does the Imam have a cool outfit? The outfits are kind of mid. I don't know. I'm not sure if I can give them A tier. The logo is so dope, though. The logo's really sick. Everything else seems pretty mid. But I do like logos. We'll go, we'll go top of B tier. House of Wisdom. Another cool logo. The House of Wisdom, the scientific center of the Muslim world. Now this is really cool because this historically is very pertinent. Oh, he's angry. He's an angry guy. Why can't you see their outfits? The game's broken. I really like the House of Wisdom as an idea. The logo's cool. The description's good. Of course, I have no idea what the outfits are. We should probably do division outfits another day, but I'm taking everything into account. For this one, we're going to do A tier, House of Wisdom, very based. Next faction. <sighs> Pole's not looking too good for Dark Souls, but Helldivers 2 and Lionheart's looking good. We're playing Lionheart's right now. Remember. I might do a giveaway at any one of these places, so do your best to try to follow me. Oh! Oh, I have an idea. Let's re let's restart. Cuz I'm just going to join these potentially. So, we're going to restart or we're going to reevaluate based on these outfits. Just the low rank outfit. So this faction doesn't, this sub-faction doesn't have an outfit. Oh, you know what? I don't think you get it as an applicant. So this isn't, this strategy is not going to work. Never mind. Abort mission. Abort mission. We're back to what we were doing. Champions of the Order. Champions of the Order are an elite tier of assassins in the Order of Assassins known for their advanced sword fighting ability and discipline. They are a source of great pride within the order and have an honor of wearing the prestigious Black Champion Road. So this used to be known as Spade Devi Assassini back in the day. And then it was renamed when we did the English translations to Champions of the Order. These guys were really elite back in the day. Um, super sick, super sick division. Used to wear all black. And we used to scare the hell out of colonial groups when we raided them. Again, my assassin bias is coming in here. Champions of the Order, S tier. Sir Kaiser Gaming is now following. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Champions of the Order is going to be our first S tier entry. Guardians of the Order. 
The colors in the Guardians are a little bland, but the Dominuses are sick. Um, they were first my personal bodyguard in the Assassins. Um, very cool. Doesn't quite have the history of champions, um, but is very, very cool. Great faction, great division. We're going to give them high A tier. Next we have Scholars of the Order, also known as Contrati back in the day. They're still making YouTube videos contracting people. These guys are very, uh, very cool. Um, they're like the assassin division of the assassins. They're the most secretive assassins, which is why they say that they are assassins in their group description. Contrati Scholars, another S tier. Slightly below champions, but very good. Scholars is an awesome division. They wreak havoc and terror. Tuna the Random is now following. Thank you for the follow. Make sure everybody's subscribed to YouTube, guys. Um, we're going to start really growing this channel and be using it to promote Lionhearts more and more. Uh, so we can get more and more recruits. So the more you support the channel, the more you tune into the live streams, the more recruits you will have. Um, and please leave a like on the stream as well. Uh, next, we have Vanguard of the Order. This used to be called Recognitori. And uh, Recognitori never ended up doing anything. Vanguards, uh, they've never really accomplished anything. Um, it was kind of a failed division back in the day. Uh, and I've never heard them doing anything since. D tier. There, you know, I'm not totally assassin biased because I'm giving an assassin division D tier. Next, we have the Ayyubid Sultanate. Damascus is so freaking gorgeous. I love Damascus. I love Damascus. I love Damascus. Chicken on our poll. Still 70% saying Lionhearts. The city was planned to be a lot bigger, but Roblox couldn't handle it. It was too epic. View here. Damascus was too epic, so I had to actually end up scrapping a lot of what I had built and planned. That's why the the markets are so caged off. Next we have the Ayyubid Sultanate. Emirate of Damascus. First off. Sick logo. Sick logo. Formed by Saladin when he reconquered Syria from the Crusaders in 1182. Historical origin, very based. One of the primary powers of the Sultanate when Saladin has, began his conquest of Jerusalem. Almost a thousand members. Um, I think the uniforms, like all Ayyubid uniforms, don't look that good. But when you take the logo and the description, how based it is historically into effect, this is a solid A tier faction. I would even put it at top of A tier. Amazing logo. Um, it's got a lot of members and a uh, cool faction. I don't really like these just recolored logos. I like when they're unique. Emirate of Aleppo. They began to bring stability to the city surrounding Aleppo and Damascus.
Again, the outfits are pretty mid. The logo is really mid. And the description is just okay. This is just a C tier for me. It's a C tier. The green looks slightly better. Emirate of Cairo. Majority of the Ayyubid army. Centralized in Cairo. When's the last time you had Cairo, Ayyubids? Quit joshing us. Outfits are slightly better. Still going to be C tier. But a little higher. We're moving along. Next, we got the important... We're going to the D tier base, which I still don't like admitting is a D tier base. And we have to take a short one second intermission. One. Okay, we're in the city of love, Constantinople, the furry city, some may call it. I haven't been here since the new trees. It's nice. Some have called it the furry city. Some have called it that. I haven't called it that. That's not what I would call it. Some people have called this city furry city. And that may be why it was in D tier. But, honestly, I would have given it C tier, but people would have fucking raged if I gave it C tier. So, it is for that reason I caved and gave it D tier. Some people have called it Furry City. I don't know who. I won't be surprised if the Byzantines straight up kill me here. The Byzantines do not like me. There's no secret that the Byzantines don't like me. Oh, look, they added some windows to the walls. Interesting. Looks a lot better than it used to. Uh, maybe it needs to be in C tier. Maybe my rating was too harsh. I mean, the square looks really nice. Let's see what they did to the walls. And then we'll rank their divisions. Yeah, like, this view sucks. I tried to do my best to hide the fact, like, I tried to make it an illusion. Like, with fog, so I tried to make it hide the fact that there was nothing there. But when you add these things, it makes that kind of impossible. So here we are. In, uh, what some would call, but not me... Oh my god, there's a woman playing Lionhearts. What some would call, not me, some would call it Furry City. Not me, but some would. Um, I don't think I can stream in 1080 without giving up faster reactions to chat.
It's still delayed. The chat's still delayed, so maybe I should... Yeah, I should still... I should move it back to 1080. I will. Although, I think the replays look okay. Um, let's look at these divisions. Um, I'm still in Normandy on my, my Credenzio account, I think. First we have Auxiliary Turcouples. Turcouples are pretty based. Turcouples are cool. Turcouples are cool. This is like Turks serving the Byzantines. They're pretty- that outfit is pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. That's a sick outfit. Um, if not for this outfit, this might be a C tier, because I really don't like the logo. I don't like the logo at all. It just totally looks out of place. But because of the outfits and all that, we're going to give it top of B tier. The outfit's really carrying them there. Next we have Imperia Tagmata. Horsemen raised from the plains of Thrace, Macedon, and Thessaly. They make up the core imperial army and include units such as horse ar archers, which is pretty cool. Oh, those, u those low rank uniforms are unique. The Byzantines do have drip with their outfits, for sure. For sure. Um, this one, though, it's still just B tier for me. I like the logo better, so it's going to go above to a couple, although the uniforms are slightly worse. Uniforms are slightly worse. Okay, by the way, guys, the number, the lucky number today is 15. 15. That means every 15 concurrence we will do a giveaway. And the giveaway we are doing today is free access to Lionhearts for you and your friends. That is at least one of the giveaways we are doing. That means if you win, you get to enter yourself or your friend in to get free access. Every 15 concurrence. Right now we are at 28. We get two more. That will be 30. We hit, we hit 30 earlier. So we are doing two giveaways already. If we get to 45... We will do three, just so you know. We will do three concurrent. We will do three giveaways. Um, two, two, you know, one or two of which at least will be uh, for free to access. Okay, I announced it. I'm helping you guys out. I did a double ping. It's now all you know, as this Byzantine furry is now shaking his fist. Here we are. Okay. We're back, baby. All right. Imperial Tegmata. We just ranked these guys. Next, we have Them of Thessaloniki. Not Theme of Cyprus. No, no, no. Um, so we're back up to that 30 number, guys. That means two giveaways. Just get up to 45, and we will be doing that. If you want to give somebody in your life free access, if you have a special someone in your life, special certain sweetheart that you'd like to give free access, like this fine individual on screen here, wow, then you could do it. 
You can do it. Leave a like also, by the way, guys. Um, theme of Thessaloniki was a military district of the Eastern Roman Empire. It's the capital and prestigious city of Thessaloniki. Second largest city in the empire and often considered capital of the empire. It was led by a governor who's known as Du of Thessaloniki. Full cool outfits. I think this is a solid low A tier. Mm, high B. High B tier. Cool, cool division. The Byzantines are very well put together because they've had a lot of developers... Uh, that have been volunteers. A lot of people from Byzantines have volunteered, so they have a lot of say, historically, in, you know, improving the faction. Which means if you want to help improve your faction and have more of a say, not in a biased way, but just represent your faction in the development studio, you could become a volunteer today, apply, sign an NDA, and you could help the studio if you have any development skills, I know right now that the balancing team is taking applications. Varangian Guard, originating as mercenaries from the cold north, Scandinavia, Russia, and Anglo-Saxon England. These men are the descendants of these hardy fighters, trained with heavy weapons such as battle axes and war hammers. They are the Imperial Guard serving the Emperor. Wow. Varangian Guard, historically very sick, very cool. Nice outfits. The leader has a sick out. Oh, that's a sick outfit. That's really nice. That's like an A tier outfit. Brangian Guard, just for being historically relevant, gonna go to the top of A tier. Top of A tier. And while we wait. We're going to continue the reviews. We've done the first four factions, subdivisions, a.k.a. divisions. We are going to continue with the next 12 right after a brief break. I will be back within a few minutes, and I will see you all in Nicosia. Don't go anywhere if you don't want to win the giveaway. You can leave, but if you want to win the giveaway, you should probably stick around.
We're back. And we're greeted by Lettuce, Emperor of the Cy Emperor of the Cypriots. Being Emperor of the Cypriots may be blasphemy, depending on your political position. At least they own Cyprus, right? I mean, at least they own Nicosia right now. That's nice for them. Here we are. Cyprus. Divisions. Ooh. These logos are pretty, looking pretty fire off the bat. Thematic Guard of Perennia. Hardened warriors to its ranks. Destroying enemies' formations with crushing attacks. Very cool. Cool outfits in that Byzantine style. Very nice. It's not push me off. Might affect your ranking. You harass me. Um, this is just a B tier. I'd say like above tier couples, yeah. Oh, I do like the logo. Paphos. Cataphract. Paphos cataphracts. Paphos cataphracts are the protectors of the empire holds, using their shields as a safeguard for the emperor and each other. Their brotherhood bond is as strong as their shields and determination to protect the empire. Paphos is the city where Aphrodite did the Greeks. I would know if I wasn't killed in the middle of that. Now, the one problem I have with this is that this windmill needs to be recovered, be recolored, because it does not fit the city colors at all. Dude, chill. If you guys keep harassing me, you're all gonna get F tier. I'm gonna make a new tier for you. Here we are, Hill of the Crowns. Nice. Mm. There we go. Okay. Cyprians. Second division, Paphos. They safeguard the emperor. That's pretty cool. I like the logo. Based on the cult of Aphrodite. Wow. It's cool. I really like the logo. It's very unique and like Greek. I like the logo a lot. Low A tier. For Paphos. Lordship of Limassol. I like this logo a lot as well. Deadeye Archers. This is cool. Archer divisions are very based. Archer divisions are very based. Oh, and they have the plumes on the helmets. Oh, God. That's pretty sick. Okay, this is pretty sick. Archer divisions, plumes on the base, snake logo, epic logo. This is going high A tier. If I knew more about them historically, it might be better. I just don't know anything about them. That's really cool. Sovereign Order of the Sword. This logo's got, like, way too much going on. It is cool, but it's got way too much going on. 
Okay, so this is like their elite knights division. It's cool. I, I think the logo's a little much. But it looks like a B tier to me. Now, we are going on to Kingdom of England. I gave Kingdom of England a hard time in the faction ratings. Will I be a little bit more generous to them in their division ratings? We are climbing up there, guys. If more of you went on Twitch, we would reach 45. If more of you went on Twitch, we would reach 40, 45. Right now, we're at 31 plus 5 on Twitch, 36. If you all went over to Twitch, we could even reach 60, and we'd be doing four giveaways. Just so you know. I really find it hard to believe that you guys think old Jaffa is better than new Jaffa. New Jaffa is way cooler. It's not mid, dude. It's much better. Now, the lack of the round table in there is a little infuriating. I can, I can see why that would be upsetting. Let's look at the Kingdom of England. Let's look at that Kingdom of England. We are 43. Only 10 of, only five of you went over to Twitch as well. Just a couple more and we will get to that num num lucky number 45 for our third giveaway. If you guys have it in you. Coup going on in England. Oh no, Furious. Not Furious, he's been around forever, man. Oh my god. What did they do to these logos? Oh! These logos are really not it. I'm sorry to whoever made these, but they're really not it. They're very ugly. This is sad because I wanted to... I wanted to give KOE better rankings for their divisions. Because I think their divisions could be cool. Lancaster. No division? No lo- No description? Okay, this is either negligence from devs or something. The uniforms are cool. The uniforms are very cool. But no description. 1,400 members and no description. And a, just an ugly logo. Ugly logo. Just ugly. Uh, this is going to have to be low C, guys. I mean, this is really bad. And why is it... Did I go out of order? No. Maybe I did. But this is going to have to go low C, man. The only thing keeping it out of D are those uniforms and its member count. That's really bad. <sighs> Next, we have the Duchy of Aquitaine. <laughs> Uglier logo, and no de description. Uniforms are pretty mid. This one is going. This one's going D tier for me. This one's going D tier. There's nothing even to say about it. Bottom of D tier, Duchy of Aquitaine. Next, we have the Duchy of Normandy, which is the one I joined, and the uniforms in Normandy are actually like the best. Normandy's division outfits might be the best in the game. They are actually dope. 
And that's like the only reason I'm in Normandy is because their outfits are so sick. And they match my helmet. They're very good. No description. Logo is okay. It's the least ugly of all of them, but still pretty bad. Comparatively to some of the other ones we saw. No description is pretty painful. Despite all that, the uniforms are so drip it's going bottom of A tier. The uniforms are the only thing keeping this ship afloat. The only thing. Next we have the Hospitallers. We're at 40, guys. Just five more concurrents and we reach that lucky number. This, this beat is actually really sick. Hospitallers, another faction that I've spent a lot of time in. actually know a little something about these divisions. Cross the Hospitallers. This logo is one of the best, to be honest. Cross the Hospitallers logo is one of the best. And Cross the Hospitallers is quite a legendary division. Their uniforms are just okay. Logo's goaded, uniform's okay, good history. I think this just barely keeps them out of S tier. Yeah, just barely out of S, I would say. Very high A here for Cross the Hospitallers. You guys can see I like gold logos. Next we have Lang of Castile. Shadow of the Order. Also very cool division. Neat logo. Very unique. These are the guys that wear red. Yeah, these uniforms are a lot better. Good uniforms. Not great. Okay, good logo. Not great. Um, good description. I'm gonna get this just a B tier. Probably a Top of B tier, though? Yeah, I think top of B tier is fair. Not quite A. Top of B. Next, we have Order of St. Lazarus. No description. These are the green boys. Yeah, the greenies. It's kind of ugly. I know the historical relevance of it so i'm not going to give too much 
bad against it, but this is C tier for sure. This is low C. Sure. And the logo is just the Hospitaler logo. So this actually could be bottom of C tier. Bottom of C tier is feels appropriate to me. Feels appropriate. Okay. Who's next on the chopping block? HRE. I've got a good feeling about this one. We're about halfway done. Can I give Normandy new ranks? No, but one of the volunteers can. Somebody at the office. Oh, they were waiting for me. Cog, the based man that he is, watched my stream for like six hours yesterday, my second stream, where we stream Dark Souls. And it was very late at night for a lot of you, because I know a lot of you are Europeans. But we had a great time. KOE stuff is being updated. Good, because they are in pitiful shape. This should be the leading faction of the genre. It's literally their leader is the logo. We call, we call Furious Wraith the logo. That's his nickname. Okay, these outfits are actually really sick. Like, it's just as far as uh, Germanic heraldry goes. Very colorful, very unique. I think I'm going to be giving these guys some favorable reviews. Furious Wraith, also known as the logo. Braden, add a new title for Furious Wraith that's called the logo. Please. Before he gets cooed. Can't coo the logo. Here we are, HRE. Oof. Woo! Damn! These are some nice logos. The Bohemia one's my least favorite, but it's still nice. And they literally, look at this, I scripted this scroll bar in case it became too long, and they're usually, they're using my scroll bar. Extra based. Their division's so important, it needs to take up more, more screen than screen. Duchy of Bohemia, situated in Central Europe, was a principality within the Holy Roman Empire during the early and high Middle Ages. It was formed in 874 by the Czechs, part of the Great Moravian Realm. So the cool thing about HRE is they're like provinces of the empire, which I think is really cool. Okay, this is sick. That's a sick outfit. That is really sick. That's really sick. The checkered is sick. This is an A tier for me. It's gonna be bottom of A tier because I don't like the logo. And the uniforms are good. They're not great. Duchy of Bavaria. Very cool. Frontier region in the southeastern part of the Merovingian kingdom from the 6th through the 8th century. Hold on one second. Frontier region. New duchy was created from this area from the decline of the Carolingian Empire. Very cool. 
Outfits very unique, a little bit ugly, but I appreciate I appreciate how colorful they are. Like, this one doesn't quite work, but it's bold. It's like it's like you tried something, which I appreciate. And the logo is very cool. So these are gonna go at the top of B tier for me. Good, not great. Duchy of Saxony. Settled the Saxons, that's based. Early Middle Ages, Carolingians. Woo! Wow. They're so busy, but it's like, it's so good at the same time. It really feels unique. It just feels great. It just feels great. It really does. This really does. I think I'm gonna have to put these in A tier as well. Um, yeah, I think they just barely go above House of Wisdom. Great. Great. Next we have the last of HRE, County of Holland. I really like this logo. I really like it. Located in the Low Countries, the territory corresponds with roughly the current provinces of North Holland, South Holland, and the Netherlands. That's a cool uniform. That's a cool uniform. That's really cool. Dang. Wow. They're really going all out with these. Oh, I'm pretty sure that was just the Jester's outfit. Five members. I don't know if you can get higher than A on five members, but we'll put you higher than the Duchy because I really like the uniforms. Okay. Five members, kind of a shame. Next one, we may be we may be seeing an S tier out of this next one. I'm not sure. Ugh. We'll see. A with five members. Because the uniforms, man. It's because the uniforms. Uh, I'm sure they could improve. <sighs> I, I think you guys are too hard on Ascalon. I think it's pretty cool. Got a cool church. The lighting's very nice. And the graveyard's cool. And by you guys being too hard on Ascalon, the comments did enter it. it they did impact my tier list last time. KOJ, Ebelin. Ebelin has been a, fa a division, been a sub a sub faction for a very long time. Very cool outfits. I really like the color scheme, maroon and tan, or even like rust and tan. It's even different than maroon. These outfits are very nice. Has a lot of history as a, fa a sub faction. Um, honestly, Ebelin, in my opinion, is a low S tier. I know that might be controversial, but when you think about the history of them in this in this fact in this genre, I think they're a low S tier. Um, really cool uniforms, great history. Um, and the reason they're S tier is because they're almost their own faction. That's how they've been considered um, for a long time. S tier for Ebelin. Principality of Galilee. Vice oh. Roy just endorsed one dollar and twenty eight cents. Coach on top. By the way, it's my birthday. Happy birthday, Viceroy. I don't know why it didn't... Thank you for the donation. I don't know why it didn't play... Your name? I 
I don't know why it didn't play on my thing. Did you guys hear that through my mic, or did you also hear it? Okay. Well, I don't know why the alert box wasn't there. Galilee, I really don't like this logo. I think the outfits are just kind of mid. Oh, actually, they're kind of nice. I like the outfits a lot. Those are really nice. I really wish the logo wasn't so ugly. But this is going to put them in B tier. Next, we have Tripoli. Similar to Evelyn. Let's see here. Where'd our music go? Ripley has amazing uniforms. Their logo is really good. I love Tripoli. It might be my favorite division. And for that reason, Tripoli is going into S tier. Even above Evelyn. I think Tripoli is really, really cool. I think Tripoli's really cool. Tripoli's got great outfits. Great outfits, great history for that division. It's been around for a very long time. Order of the Holy Sepulchre, this one's a newer one. Woo, those are fresh. Damn, those are fresh. I was expecting to get this lower. Damn, son. Damn. Kind of a Templar look, honestly. But very cool. We're going to put these in A tier. Oh, wrong. A tier. KOJ has won the division competition so far. It's between KOJ and ACEA. They're, they're dominating. KOJ doing a great job with their divisions. Oh, okay. We're going to do a little competition at Acker. I hope you guys are all ready. We are doing the first giveaway at Acker. Um, and you guys are not in game at Acker. You have no chance of winning this giveaway. The Acker giveaway. So please answer the poll in YouTube. For the first giveaway, do you want a free helmet or do you want paid access for yourself or a friend? That is the question. Roblox is down. Very nice. Speaking of something being down, who took away the freaking ambient and fog at Acker to make it look so ugly? So ugly. Is Roblox really down? Not down for me. I'm looking at it fine. Yeah, I know Leo's in there. You guys put Leo in the church. It's <laughs> pretty funny.
Come to Acker. I think that it's back up if it was down. Hello, Damien. Let's do the divisions while we wait for everybody. France! Renshiro. Flanders, Burgundy, Tolo, and Verdun. Now these logos are top. I had no idea France had such sick division logos. These might be the best logos so far. County of Flanders. That's not the outfit. Whew. Those are really tight. Those are really tight. Those are really sick. Hog, you can't just teleport to me. Flanders is getting an A. A tier is becoming a little crowded. There's a lot of good divisions. Burgundy? I don't like the logo quite as much. And the uniforms are kind of ugly. Yeah, I don't really like these uniforms that much. It's gonna be like a low C, I think. Um, oh wait, wrong one. Mid C. Rip Burgundy. Toulouse. Raymond of Toulouse. Oh, yeah, these outfits are pretty sick. That's like a solid B tier. That's a solid B tier. Uh, yeah, B tier. Top of B tier, I'd say. Very nice. Very nice. Verdun. Wow. They almost look like two tonics. That's really neat. I really like their logo. I really like their logo. Um, B, B tier, I think, is fair. Damn, this is a long tier list. Okay, next we have... Our competition in Acker for the first giveaway. Whoever can catch me will be winning this giveaway. When I stop, whoever's closest to me. Ah!
I'm always trying to hit me, so I... That's so dumb. You can't kill me. If you kill me, you lose. <laughs> if I die, you lose, and you don't get anything, just so you know. Because I don't have enough stamina on this account, I think. Makes this a little bit harder. And stop! Desire J Pop has won. Congratulations. Desire J Pop has won the competition. Please DM me with what helmet? No, one helmet. Please DM me which helmet skin you would like. Unless you won again earlier, but yeah, send me your user ID on Discord. And. Uh, yeah, sometimes you're too slow. You won't get the giveaway, guys. I don't know what to say. Next giveaway will not be in-game. Or maybe it will. I don't know. Some salty people. You want the game. Next, Kingdom of Sicily. Apulia. Cool logo. Cool outfits, actually. Apulia is going to get B tier. Benevento. I like this. Wow. Oh, those outfits are like top. They're very sick. A tier for sure. Those outfits are really sick. Benevento A tier. Naples, no description. That sucks.
Outfits are just kind of mid. It's going to go C tier. C tier for Naples. Amalfi, no description. Outfit's pretty cool. That's sick. Um, B tier. Mid B tier. That's it for Sicily. Okay, so whoever's going in these places and removing the atmosphere, stop. Stop removing the atmosphere. It makes the Roblox drain look terrible. Stop removing the atmosphere. Seriously, somebody needs to go through and put the atmospheres back in. Makes the places look so much worse. Okay, Mosul's pretty sick, though. Zangit Divisions. These logos are really cool. I don't know why they're on a Star of David, but... Spearhead of the Emirate. Sick. Cool outfits. They an Archer Division? They have bows on them. Really cool. Really cool. Definitely A tier for Dohuk. Definitely A tier. A lot of A tiers here. Sword of the Emirate. Cool logo. Formal way of governing other territories. These are just the same outfits that the other ones have? Surely not. Okay. Yeah, this is cool. It's like a blue version. I I'd say it's not quite as nice as the next one. The last one. So I would go B tier for... Um, for Adabagate of Sinkar. This logo, very good. Shield of the Emirate. Hardened Guardsman. Are these the ones that play soccer all day? Ew. <laughs> Uniforms are very mid. Outfits, uh, the shield is cool. Uniforms are very mid. For that reason, C tier. Top of C tier. Uniforms are very gross. Not in a good way. I was also I've been hard on Antioch this week. Will they get some redemption in their sub factions? Is the question. Ugh. Will they get some redemption?
I don't think you could say Antioch is a bad bit. This is sick. It looks really cool. It looks really cool. It is not bad. Uh, I'm kind of just doing a scattered approach with the uniforms. Divisions, Sion, Holy Lance, Mercenaries, and Latica. These are really cool logos. You guys need to, everybody ping Vainwood to start video editing. Ping him. Start video editing, Vainwood. Oh my god, why aren't you video editing? Get to video editing, man. Why is it broken? Lordship of Sion, Frankish blood. Can't tell which their uniforms are. That's pretty cool. This is feeling like a bee. Yeah, it's okay. Feeling like a B tier. Order of the Holy Lance. Love the logo. Awesome historical reference. I hope that's not their outfits. I really wanted to give them a high rank. Okay, these outfits are cool. This is going to go into A tier, but just barely. Because of the... Because of the cool logo. Because of the cool logo and the historical relevance of the story of the Holy Lance, which is really cool. Arminian Cecilia. Cilicia. Cilicia. Better uniforms. Better. Cool logo. B tier. Um, yeah, B tier. Last, we have Latica. Latakia. Lordship based out of Laodicea, located in Northern Levant. Lordship specializes in heavy weaponry and archery. Archery divisions are sick. The outfits, cool. A little low res. Cool master outfit. Uh, I'm going to put these at the top of B tier. Maybe right under Toulouse. Okay, we're done with Antioch. Next up, getting close to the end, Seljuks.
doing another giveaway. We might do two more. Amira looks so much better now with these outskirts. <laughs> Welcome to my Palmyra, brother. Let me bring you to my bunker. <laughs> Seljuk Sultanative Room. I really don't like when they just use the same logo recolored. But this middle logo is cool. They need some new logos. This is a D tier. <laughs> This is D tier for sure. Not good. That's like bad logo, ugly uniforms, D tier. Galuman one Kayastarian. Now the logo is very cool. Tactic and goals. Cool. Kind of all right. I think this is a solid B. Uh, we'll go A tier because the logo is so cool. Logo is very cool. Uniforms are just all right. This one, a blurrier version of the Celtic logo. Hmm. Outfits are at least a little unique, that kind of yellow. In its own ugly way. Uh, definitely C tier. Low C. Actually, no. D tier. Just hop a D tier. Because it's just the Seljic freaking logo, man. It's just a blurrier Seljic logo. Templars, this will be fun. Templars and Teutonics are our last ones. That's a cool outfit. House of Wisdom outfit? Well, I gave House of Wisdom a really good rank, dude. House of Wisdom's at the top of A, man. Isn't it? Yeah, it's an A. We'll move it up a little bit in A. How about that? Because that outfit was sick. My good friend Tilla is here. We should have done this, get everybody with their di <laughs> Thank you. We, we should have gotten everybody in with their divisions at their bases, like, lined up, showing off. Till is king of Jerusalem? Hello, king. I didn't know that. Thank you. Okay, logos, very simple. Low resolution, but nice. You might say, why am I rating these better than the other ones that are just recolors? Because these are actually kind of distinct. First, we have big back we have big black cross. Black cross is a great division. They're a meme division. Their outfits are very simple but good. Um, and because of the simplicity, 
uh, and the memes, Black Cross gets an S tier. You don't need to do you don't need to do too much like HRE. You just need to succeed succeed in your own way. Um, I might even put them above. No, not quite above scholars. Next we have Grandmaster's Guard. These one this is nothing special. Grandmaster's Guard. I mean the outfits are nice, but it's like a B tier. Enter couples, which are very cool. Very cool outfits for tur couples. Very cool. Um, going to give them a high A tier. High A tier for tur couples. I lost the YouTube chat a little bit ago. Hope I didn't miss too much. Yeah, that took a couple outfits are very cool. Hello, Templars. Last but not least, we hope, the Teutonic Knights. Let's review our tier list so far. A lot of A, a lot of B, very few S, very few D. Um, which, it makes for a good tier list, I think. There are a lot of great divisions. There are a lot of great outfits. Um, and there are some divisions, I think, in C and D tier that need a lot of work. New logos, new identities, you know, so. Oh, these pine trees look really good. Hello, my friends, the Teutonics. Teutonic Guards, Rangers, and Lubeck. The logos are okay, not great. Outfits. It's kind of neat. In like a mid kind of way. I don't know if I like it. Teutonic Guards. It just comes off as very bland. Like, I get what you're trying to do with the gray, but it just comes off as very bland. C tier. Teutonic Rangers. Like these these outfits don't even look like it, their uniforms literally look like nothing <laughs> d tier they don't look they don't look like uniforms d tier for rangers not a good start for teutonics let's see if lubeck can redeem them Offensive styles. This is this. It's like the same. There's nothing going on here. It's just there's just not. There's nothing. It's so bland. Nothing going on. I'm disappointed. Teutonics, disappointed in your divisions. Too like this is disappointing for sure. This is really disappointing for Teutonics. Um, but we finished our tier list. 
the best divisions in the game. <sighs> uh, maybe I was too hard on the Guardians, though. I'm going to give them a C. Wait, is that range? No, I did give them a C. I'm going to give them a B because I do. I think it looks better than I thought originally, but still, Teutonic's not good. This is the end of the, of the tier list. So that's it. That's it. We're done. Looks like another assassin victory. Yeah? Looks like another assassin victory. Um, I think assassins, templars, KOJ really stole the show. Coming after that would be Byzantines. Probably, uh, HRE, France, Hospitallers. Yeah. What do you guys think of this tier list? Besides your division, do you agree with the tier list? Yes or no? All yeses so far. Controversial. I know. It's a controversial one. It took forever. A long tier list. Varangian should be S tier. Well, they've, the list is already complete. Sorry. We've got our S tiers. And uh, Varangian guards at the top of A. Black Cross for their memes. Big Black Cross. S tier. Well, it looks like I won the poll, just barely. 52% agree with the... 51% agree with the poll, 57 do not. I don't know how that math adds up. Finally, the last giveaway. Or for now, last giveaway. Declare war on me. I might be streaming again in a bit this afternoon. Uh, if you guys would like to join me, there will be more giveaways. More things like that. We'll be playing Helldivers 2, potentially. So Dark Souls, potentially. Let's see, where is the giveaway? Okay. Free helmet of your choice. 
Starting now. Make sure you are in the YouTube comments. This raffle will end in two minutes. If you rally one soldier, can I make it? 30 seconds left to answer the, enter the raffle, guys. And 30 seconds left. Looks like the raffle has closed. We have 23 entries. And I will be picking the, the winner myself. Me. Picking the winner. And that winner... Uh, who will the winner be? The question. Who is the winner? Who we pick? The winner has been picked. Onion Master 24. Onion Master, would you rather have a free helmet or paid access for yourself or a friend? Congrats on you, Master. We're very proud of you. We're very proud of you. Helmet it is. What is your what is your username on Discord? Please message me. By the way, Heidi, Stefan Bordarki, Luke the Master, Angry Player 009, and Onion Master, I owe you giveaway stuff. I am waiting on user IDs and eligible prizes. Please DM me. If you've not received these yet, I've been trying to reach you guys and get these out to you. Your grandma's proud of you. Congratulations. Congratulations, congratulations. Congratulations.
I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Debating whether or not to keep going or not. I'm still streaming. I'm still streaming. Crack one. I... I streamed for a long time yesterday, let's be honest. A long time yesterday. I did nine hours yesterday. <laughs> Cowards have left. Yeah, Cat Wonder, you did forget to talk at the end of the giveaway. You did forget to talk at the end of the giveaway yesterday. At the end of my seven hour live stream. I didn't know the stream was not 16 hours. It was two plus seven, which is nine. My friends, nine. By the way, myth, Stephen Bordarki. I told you, DM me. You haven't DM'd me. What is your Discord name? Stefan Bord Borodaki, I, I still need your Discord name, buddy. Yeah, DM me again. Hidden? That's you? Okay, I'm gonna... I got you written down, don't worry. Don't worry, you'll be getting taken care of. I got you. Daylight savings is messing my life up, man. Went to bed at 10 last night. It took me till 1 a.m. to fall asleep. I was in bed for three hours. Not looking at my phone. Just in bed. Sitting there for five, three hours. Just... Brutal.
What do you guys think we could do to improve these streams? We're going to be doing three a week minimum. Um, but I'm going to be streaming probably a lot more just sporadically. The scheduled ones are going to be Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday at 11.30 a.m. EST. I wish Arena was fixed. I know, I do need to start streaming Arena again, but it's uh, broken. I got you, dude. I told you, Stefan. I got you. You'll be given the giveaway very soon. I just was... It's very hard to... When people's YouTube names are different than their... Discord and Roblox names, it's just very confusing to keep track of. Maybe uh, Brandon could find a... Bra Brayden, not Brandon. Um, find a way to actually keep track of everything. Maybe like a, a different website where you can like enter in... I think we're going to have to do games later. Um, I'll probably get on the stream later. Um, uh, like three hours from now, probably. Yeah. Two or three hours from now. Please come back. Love to see you. Thanks, guys, for tuning in. That was great. Bye-bye.